Hi everyone, so today we are going to do a PP or potassium permanganate treatment. Um, so I noticed a couple of the koi were looking um, veined up um, and rubbing the cells off the side of the walls of the pond. So I had one of them out and sure enough um, we've got trick. So no flukes, no costia, just trick. So them are generally the three that I've had in the past. Um, so to treat the trick we're going to use PP. So, you must have a good set of scales. So obviously these are the very lightweight ones, which are very accurate. And just again, just to test, what I've done is, is that search on the internet, 20p weighs five grams. So we'll put that on there. And you can see there, it's just over. I'm not gonna worry about uh, two digits past the decimal point there. So we've weighed out um, one dose. So the following calcs I've done, so I've got a 12,000 litre pond. Um, we need to divide that by 4564, which is 1,000 gallons, which I'll show you on the um, instructions on the packet in a minute. Um, so that's 2.62. And then we've got a times 2.62 by 6.8. So that should be 6.8 grams, which is <coughs> what the um, recommended dosage is per 1,000 gallons or 4,564 litres. And that gives us a total of 17.88 grams of PP. So that's for the first dose that we put in. Now what I also do, which I was recommended off a, a few uh, people and, and various dealers, get a half dose ready. Because as soon as that PP starts to go brown, it starts to fade from that purple colour, you need to put a half dose in. And you can half dose as many times as you want. Now, if you haven't used PP before, what you'll find is is the it'll go off quite quickly because it's burning up all that organic matter in the pond. So you must get that half dose ready, and you must watch it for the four hours of the dose. Don't go off the packet, which we'll have a look at that now and see something like 15 hours, which is totally unnecessary. So there you've got there a minimum total of 15 hours. It's got of purple coloured water. So again, I think everyone in the in the hobby just uh, goes to four hours, okay? And obviously make sure that uh, your pond aeration's on. Don't bypass your filters because the bugs will be in there as well. And you can just see there on the bottom, that's the um, 6.8 grams per 4,564 litres or 1,000 gallons. So I've done the calculation and we're all ready to go, okay? The other thing that people do sometimes is have some hydrogen peroxide on hand. So this basically neutralizes the PP so you can either just let it go off by itself after the four hours or stick this in um, and that'll neutralize it instantly. The other thing is obviously if any of your fish are struggling, then you can have this on hand and, and neutralize it straight away um, and check them out and make sure they're okay. Okay, because it is quite a severe treatment and that's why you must use one of these um, more accurate scales. Don't just get your kitchen scales out and things like that. They might be accurate, but generally um, they're not, so you, you must get a, one of these. See, they really are cheap. You get them off eBay. And like I say, just always just do that check with some known weights. Okay, so the 20 minutes piece is what I use. Right, we'll um, get this mixed up, uh, get in the pond, and fingers crossed, everything goes to plan. So I've used the feeding air supply to mix the PP up in the bucket. And then we'll add that to the pond. That's it, that's all the PP in. Very purple. And now I've just got to sit back, watch for it going off, and then as soon as we see it starting to go a more brownie colour, then we've got to throw the next half dose in. And obviously you can't let it go fully brown. Otherwise, um, you've just wasted your time, basically. You need to leave it a day or so um, and start all over again. You've got to keep it that purple colour. Right, so we're just over 30 minutes into the treatment and I think it's starting to go off already. Koi look a bit more visible than what they did before. So I've got the half dose brewing on the side there. We'll get that in. 
and uh, go again. Just keep an eye on them. Just in case I have got it wrong, but it definitely looks as though it's, it's gone from a purple to a, a pinky colour. Right, so that's the treatment over with. Looking a little bit sorry for the cells. So it is starting to go off again. But I'm still going to add some uh, HP. <coughs> so with this it's 25 mils. thousand litres I think. Let's have a look. Yeah, twenty five mil per thousand litres, so basically we'll just see a twelve ish of these just scattered evenly over the pond. Hopefully that'll neutralise it. So you can see there, literally just put the hydrogen peroxide in and the water's cleared up straight away. Still got a little bit of a tinge to it, but obviously that's to be expected. So the plan is to give these a day to recover and then we'll get a couple out for a scrape and make sure all that uh, trichodina is gone. Right, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, should have some more pond videos uploaded very soon. Thanks, guys.